Hey guys, it's me, Desiree Marie. I'm back. Today I want to show you over 10 hairstyles that I like to do with my semi freeform hair. Now, if you have semi freeform dreadlocks like me, you will definitely benefit from this selection of hairstyles. Enjoy! So this first hairstyle is not a stranger at all. <laughs> it is the half up, half down hairstyle. First, I want to moisturize my hair, make sure that it's perfectly in shape for hairstyling. And I just grab a goodie band, go ahead and put a bun on top, fix it up a bit, and it's finished <laughs> in less than a minute. Ladies, sometimes the struggle is real, but we have a solution here. I am doing the half up with the space buns on top. This is such a cute and youthful style. If you want to look a little playful, have some fun, you can also add in lock jewelry with this. Right now I don't have a whole lot, so I'm just doing it here. And yeah, this is one of my favorite hairstyles when I go out. Now this is one of my most favorite hairstyles. It is the space bun hairstyle. So what I'm doing differently from the last look is basically pulling up all of my hair and putting it up into buns. You always want to make sure not to pull your hair too tight. If you feel that it is too tight, you can loosen it up a bit, but it's very easy. You just need two goodie bands and you are pretty much done. <laughs> I like to leave my bangs messy because I feel like it gives a nice edgy look. You can also leave a few locks down on the back if you choose. Here I decided to sweep everything up. But yeah guys, this is what it should look like. Add some pins to fix up the look and you're done. So I know that a lot of us don't want space buns. Well, there is an alternative. You can just have one bun in the back. What I do is take out the space buns, rough up the front, and put it up into a messy ponytail. You can add some locks to leave down on the back. If you choose to sweep everything up, that's fine. I put it into a bun and just leave the bangs very messy on purpose. If you're not into the messy look, you can fix it up however you choose. This is the look! So when you have semi-freeform locks, you are not exactly retwisting, so your roots are very poofy. Well, in order to combat that, you can do this hairstyle. Here I'm taking a section of my hair and sectioning off the other side in order to do flat twists on one side. Here's how I do it. I make sure to wet my hair and just go ahead and flat twist. I secure it with a bobby pin and I do at least two more on top of this one here. In total, I have three flat twists laying on one side of my head. This style does not require gel at all and you do not have to twist tightly you can twist very loosely and when you secure it with the bobby pin it looks just as good as anything else <laughs> here I'm just fixing up the flat twist and making sure that I like it you know it's suitable to my standards another thing that you do not have to worry about are clean parts here you can see I do not have clean parts at all it's a great messy hairstyle it does not have to be super clean and neat I think it adds funky, you know, a funky character and just a nice look. Now guys, this is my favorite hairstyle. You are basically adding from the last hairstyle. Um, you're leaving the flat twist on one side and you're creating flat twist on the other side. Here I am sectioning off my head off one way and I am adding in the flat twist of course you secure it with a hairpin and you repeat the process three times um, I think I did three times here <laughs> I'm 
taking down the front bang and I'm making sure to allow it to lay flat and forward so that it has a nice messy look. You can leave your hair just like that or you can pull it up into a bun. This is my favorite way to wear this hairstyle because it looks so funky. What I'm doing here is pinning down my hair, but I'm making sure that there is a lock or two that is sticking up. I think it adds a very funky look. Um, yeah. <laughs> very boho, very shabby chic. classic girl you can opt for this next hairstyle here I'm leaving the flat twist on the sides of my hair but I am spraying the back and doing a classic French roll I'm securing the roll with pins as I go along the top and I am adding in a cute hair clip to the back I'm allowing my locks to fall but I am pinning the ones that are a little stubborn next hairstyle reminds me a lot of high school. Um, during that time, a lot of us were doing the bump on the front, the faux hawk look. Well, this is nothing new. This is, um, you know, a little bouffant looking hump in the front. I'm securing it with pins, of course, and yeah, you can pretty much leave it like this or add your favorite hair clip to the back to jazz it up a little bit concerned about edges just add water here's a hairstyle that I do a lot throughout the week when I don't want my hair in my face and I just want my I just want to feel cool you know the summertime is all about staying cool especially when you have locks here I'm grabbing one of my longest uh, pieces of fabric and I'm tying it three times around my hair Perfect if you're into that bohemian look like me and if you just want to stay cool. Now here's a look that is inspired by another YouTuber here on YouTube. This is the Tony Daily Wrap. If you know Tony Daly, you know that she does a lot of natural hair. She also sells accessories. So this is one of the accessories that I purchased a few years ago and I still love it to this day. You can go ahead and go to her website. I will have it listed down below if you care to purchase a wrap of your own. Now on those messy hair days when you have no clue what to do with your hair, here's something you can try. Part your hair in the front and French roll your hair halfway down, of course securing it with a bobby pin on both sides. You can leave a few locks out in the front if you wish. Here I am including all of my locks into the French roll. Quick and easy. If you feel like your hair looks a little plain, you can add a funky clip to it. Now for our last look, you are basically coming from the last hairstyle but simply pinning the back all the way up so that you have an updo. So here I am of course securing the back with pins and I continue to roll it up. Don't make the mistake I made and not brush your kitchen. <laughs> 
but here's a great look if you are looking for something classic and nice looking you know ladylike feminine so there you go those are our 10 plus hairstyles that you can do with semi free form locks this one happens to be my very most favorite but which one is yours let me know down below and thank you for watching i'll see you in the next one bye bye and we and we and we